It's nickel time. This box has had better days. So I'm going to tape up around the box to make sure it stays together. Open it. Check for enders. It is circulated from what I can see on the bottom, but it's rough. I'm going to tape up the box and we'll get to this hunt. Here we go. We got one side checked. I see a lot of newer ones, but I do see some crummy ones. So we'll see. I am going to flip these ones over because I can't see through the other side of the box. So I'll flip them and we'll see what's inside. So there we go. We got them all flipped a little more organized. I do see a couple old enders. One was a 46 ender one year off of war nickel. And then we have another reverse mint mark ender there one there so we do have some old ones in the box let's see what's inside the rolls the tuck tail roll four but so far we got a 46 a little bit of ender damage out of philadelphia so there's one for the 40s let's keep going here we go next roll is a 1956 out of philly so we got one in the 50s, one in the 40s so far. Let's go. Roll six, and we might start getting some good stuff. We have a 54 out of Philly. So there's another one for the 50s. Here we go. Roll 10, and we got another one in the 50s, a 56 out of Philly. Add it to the stack and keep going. Roll 12, and it's another one, 1956. Out of Philly. I think that's our third 56 out of Philly so far. Let's keep going. Here we are, roll 18. And it was an ender. I flipped it around because I had a reverse mint mark. 1957 out of Denver. So, number 5 for the 50s. Roll 21. One year off of silver. A 46. You know we have another 46 ender in the box. And it's a 46 out of Philly. To go with the other one. Holy smokes. And roll 22. I almost swiped it. Because it was so nice. If you look at a newer. Well not that one. Let's just say a brand new. Coin. They are pretty shiny. So you swipe them pretty quick. And then you come down to this. A 2014. San Francisco. Proof. Not bad, it is dinged up quite a bit. Not a bad coin at all. So, proof find for the box. It'd be really cool if I could find two in one box. I have never found two proofs in one box. Let's see what else we can find. Roll 27, and we got a 54. Where is it from? Out of San Francisco. There we go. Not bad. So, let's look for. The over mint mark 54 S over D. So we'll pull up the scope here and we will check it out, see what we can see. Move the light. There we go. So let's see right there. I don't see it, but we'll turn up the light here. S over D. All I see is a little bit of damage there. I do see a little bit right there. That looks like just damage and dings, but I'll check it out at the book. I'll let you know at the end of the video if it is something. Roll 28, and it's colorful, but it's a 46. One year off of silver again, out of Philly. Put it up there on the 40s. And keep going. Roll 31. Here we go. I think it's a 59. But I get fooled a lot. So let's put it on the scope. Let's check it out. Just to make sure. And it is. It's a 59. Out of Philly. Alright. We'll add it to the stack. 33. And it peeked out at me. We got a war nickel. We can see it's San Francisco. What year is it? 45. 45. San Francisco. First war nickel in the box. 
and 34 it's not anything crazy but it's in really nice condition and I'm gonna save it for the book to see if it upgrades an 88 out of Denver so I'll put it up here with a couple other little finds I've got and keep going roll 38 and we've got another 46 out of Philly let's keep going roll 38 towards the end of the roll pretty shiny 59 although it's got a few dings in it out of Denver there we go roll 44 we've got another 46 oh that's an S very nice well there's a 46 again in the rolls let's check the rest of them another 64 and nothing in that we got six more rolls left so there we go all 50 rolls opened and let's see we got eight in the 50s five in the 40s one war nickel in 1945 out of san francisco and probably the good find of the box a 2014 out of san francisco a proof not bad we'll get it cleaned up shined up flipped thrown in the book so thank you guys for watching like share and subscribe all that good stuff every time and uh we will see you guys all on the next video